Damn, looks like my wallet's empty. Lunch ends in an hour though. What should I do now? Kyle! Hey! You know how you still owe me 20 bucks from Tuesday after I whoop your ass in a basketball game? Yeah, I'm going to need that money now, thank you. <laughs> and don't tell me you don't have it. I just saw you last period hand off 40 to one of your friends. If you don't cough it up, Kyle, I will kick your ass into next Wednesday in front of your friends. Thank you. Oh, hey, it's you. Quiet kid. Yes, I am aware that's not your name, but I feel like calling it out right now, so let it slide. If that's okay with you. Really? Thanks. I mean, between us, that name suits you the best. <laughs> What? Oh, you've never heard me laugh before? Well, there's a first time for anything, I guess. Hmm? Ooh, what's this? A note. For me? Well, thank you for this. Wait, wait, what? Please don't open it now. What for? You embarrassed? <laughs> I would never have imagined that could happen to you. Alright. I'll open it after you leave. Well? What are you still standing here for? Get going then! Then, room 2001. Alright, I'm here. Guess we'll see what this is all about. And he's not here. <sighs> Imagine being late to your own meeting that you set up. I suppose I'll just sit and wait. So now you decide to show up. Yeah, 10 minutes my ass. I was dying just sitting here talking to myself. <laughs> oh, trust me. I'm not someone that you want to spend time alone with. So then, what's this all about? You asked me to be here, and I showed up. If it was someone else, I never would have set foot in this room. But, because it's you, I can make an exemption. No need to thank me. I'm just doing what I want to do. Hmm? A uh, question? Uh, yeah, sure. Ask away. How long have I been at the school? Um, probably about three years now. Same as you. What about it? Favorite thing about this place? Why are you questioning me so hard? This wasn't supposed to be an interview. <laughs> Fine. My favorite and worst thing would have to be the people. They all seem scared of me in a way. I don't want to be the scary girl who would kick someone's ass in a matter of five seconds. But that's just how my reputation turned out. I get lonely sometimes, but I don't mind it. At least no one bothers me anymore. But then again, no one ever stops to talk to me anymore either. <laughs> I can still be friendly, and I am. It's just when you have a reputation of being bad, no one wants to get involved with you. Other than you, you might not talk much, but you hang around me a fair amount. 
You're one of the only people who doesn't seem absolutely frightened of me. I appreciate that. Anyway, what did you summon me here for? <laughs> Am I in trouble or something? <laughs> no? Good. So, what now? One final question? Ugh. Fine. Last one, though. Uh, what? <laughs> what? Anyone I'm interested in? Uh, um, yeah. Who? <laughs> A person? <laughs> okay, well, you never said I had to be specific. Alright, fine. I am currently interested in someone. I like them a great amount, but I'm not sure if they like me back. I think they do, but I also think they don't. They rarely ever speak to anyone, nonetheless to me. They are very nice though, smart, cute, accepting, and very generous. Are you serious? Who? You still don't know who I'm referring to? <laughs> wow, I take back the smart part. <laughs> yes, it's you. Did it take you that long to figure that out? My god, your skull is as thick as a brick. Why you? Why not you? You're amazing. You're the only person in this school with the courage to come and talk to me without any hint of fear in your voice. Even the teachers slightly fear me. I once looked weird at the science teacher and she changed my grade on the previous assignment to a B. I never asked for that. You don't fear me like everyone else does. And I respect and appreciate that. Plus, I'll admit... I kind of like the quiet type of guy. I mean, I can't stand guys that talk about themselves all the time or try to talk to me all the time. I would rather prefer someone who barely talks at all. And it makes it even better when the only person you talk to is me. I'd rather take nothing over everything. What? You were planning on confessing to me? Here? Now? Oh! <laughs> Holy shit! Okay, okay, calm down, calm down. Eprets. <sighs> okay. I'm composed. First off, excuse my language. It's just I never expected that. Well, I thought you were going to challenge me to a fight or something. Although, knowing you, that would never happen. You like me? What? You love me? Oh god, I need to sit down. This is too much for me to handle right now. <sighs> so, now I have to ask you. Why would you like me of all people? I'm the girl who could probably beat an adult in a fight. People stay away from me because they're scared they might do something to piss me off. And I'd land them in the hospital for a week. Why would you care about me? Why would you love me? Y you you like my personality. I never thought I would hear that ever in my life. Like ever. Well, that goes without saying. I am the most dazzling them when you have ever seen. Angel. I would say I'm more like the exact opposite. Not to you. Thank you. See? This is exactly why I love you. Uh, by the way, thanks for the money inside the note. I can use those hundred bucks for a good cost now. 
Wanna take a guess to what I'll use it for? No, no, not jewelry. If you're buying jewelry for $100, then whatever you're buying must be made of plastic. <laughs> I'm going to use it for the two of us. On a date. That we are going on. Yes, we are going on a date. And you can't disagree. Besides, I don't think you would say no anyway. Yep, exactly what I thought. It's a date then. I'll see you tomorrow, baby. Yes. I'm going to start calling you that from now on. Anything but that. Well, too bad. 